Uh, next up, uh huh, Twitch. I've heard of it. And making a major change to its tagging system. Oh yeah. So you can tag your streams with a certain tag, and some of the tags are really hyper specific. But now, but not, but some of the tags you want to put in there, they're just not there. Yeah, the tagging system kind of sucks on Twitch. It's like they were created when Twitch was just moving out of the games only thing. So there'd be like, they have their like live chatting section where you could be like doing other things. So they're like, a lot of these tags are like embroidery or crocheting or cooking where that's how you would find, like if you wanted to watch someone embroider, you'd look for the embroidery tag. Whereas, and there you can't do your own tag. Like, I mean, I don't know, maybe back when they set them up, they were like, well, we can't let you make your own tag because it'll just be like the fuck tag and stuff like that. <laughs> Whereas like, I mean, they have filtering options now, so it could be easier to control. Oh, yeah. Um, But yeah, they're changing it so you can put in your own tags. You don't have to go with their list. It'll be like whatever you type in. So if I wanted to put in like carpeting as a tag i could just do it i don't have yeah. to like be, have permission from twitch to do it yeah and they're changing you can have up to 10 rather than five. Oh, that's good which is the limit now so i mean most of the tags i use are just like ama no back seating like there's nothing to really choose from yeah i don't know what i'll put when i can make my own tag put in white guy white guy yeah if i can put an asian guy you can put yeah in white guy. that's kind of weird that they're doing this <laughs> Yours doesn't say Asian guy. It says Asian. No, it's just says Asian, yeah. But, like, weren't they re- not putting in tags like that to prevent people from... No, I guess they didn't remove them. Hate rating? Yeah, there was yeah, they something they out. were talking about where they didn't want to add something or they didn't want to remove them. I can't remember what it was. But you, there's still, like, the LGBTQ ones and stuff like that that you can choose. So. Yeah. Um, yeah, I mean... It's a good thing, but it'll be like let's see, let's see how it works. Basically. Yeah, <laughs> see how many uh, like they'll just crazy th- tags come up. It'll be like, oh, I can put in symbols into my tag, so all of a sudden there'll be like crazy hate tags and stuff like that coming up. <laughs> hopefully it'll be, not. It'll be an evolving. Well, hopefully not, but they'll fi- they'll f- come on. Oh yeah, they'll figure Wiener out boys how to will do figure it. it out. They'll figure out how to do it. Just go to cozy.tv if you want to do that. Yeah. Um. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see when it rolls out. And is this going to be another Twitch thing where it rolls out to, like, certain people and then six months later everybody gets it? Odds are. That's partners only to start. So, it's not even partners only for f- some of this stuff. Like, some, it just rolls out at random, it seems. <laughs> yeah, kind of. Yeah, like, Fluff mm. Tapes is not a partner, but he has the moments Twitch thing where you can, like, give a moments badge if yeah. someone was in your stream when something cool happened. Hmm. It's like yeah, when it's just does a that, random rollout. Yeah, when does that roll out to everybody? You would think that the partners would be a little bit upset if affiliates were getting it before them, or even like non affiliates. I guess so. But man, like even I mean, being a partner on Twitch it doesn't really mean that much anymore. Like it's just the numbers are high, okay, great, you're whatever, but like there's not really any crazy perks. Like, that we know of. Well, I mean but we're you not could potentially the... have a better deal with Twitch. Yeah. Plus, they're partners. They get to work on their own contracts. So you never know what else they got. But I mean, I died. That's like if you're XQC. Like if you're just like I made partner today. They're like, here's your partner contract. Yeah. And you go like, oh, I want more money. They like, no, like sign this or get out. (laughs) You don't have any sway. Maybe down the road you can renegotiate. But when you're a new partner, it's just like here's the generic contract. Sign on the dotted line. Yeah, for sure. Um. Yeah, I mean. You get a check mark, I guess. That's the main thing. Yeah. But You're verified that, now. That doesn't mean anything, really. <laughs> like, I see partners that stream to less people than I do. Yeah. So it's like... Those are usually the older partners. Yeah. But even still, there's not like it's getting them extra promotion for being a partner or no. anything. Like, you just get your little check mark and... Away you go. I guess you can start a stream team. Ah, uh, yes. That's about the only main one. <laughs> yep. Been, I've been looking for a stream team, but there's nothing that I really want to join. Sgt. Pepper's Lonely Heart Club Band. No, I'm not a huge Beatles fan. <laughs> <laughs> I also don't play like Snow Trucker or whatever the fuck he's playing. 
No, but you do play Satisfactory. Yeah, sometimes. Big Satisfactory. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways. Yeah. Anyways.